Hi everybody, my name's Keith. I'm known as the Blues Wizard. I'm out of San Diego. I'm up here, I'm going to do a video of the Ren Collective tonight playing my crazy instruments for their, their final set. I built guitars and ukuleles and basses and drums out of suitcases. And uh, my claim to fame is they don't sound like a bunch of junk, <laughs> as you will see at the show tonight. So, yeah, I uh, was really excited about being having them being close enough to my home to where I could drive up here. And How did you them. hook up with Rent Collective? Rent Collective came up, I was playing in the gas lamp in San Diego, and they were in town for a show, and they just walked up to me, and, and I'm, uh, one of, I'm a pretty good people person, and I spotted they were a band right off. I could tell just by the way they interacted. I said, you guys are a band, aren't you? And they said, yep, we're out of Northern Ireland. And uh, they said that uh, they took my business card two years ago, and they said they were going to order instruments. And I just like, okay, I get that all the time, but very few people actually get back to me. Two years later, Stephen Mitchell called me, and says, "Hey, we're ready to build instruments, and you've got three months to get them done." <laughs> so I went into high gear and, and and built all the instruments that they're going to be playing in their final set tonight. Well, I use mostly recycled materials. I uh, I'm always looking for broken instruments. Uh, I use uh, suitcase, obviously I've used suitcases that are out of the 20s, 30s, 40s, and 50s mostly. Uh, sometimes I build my own necks and usually when I do that I have a collection of recycled wood. I, I'm, a, I'm an upcycler, I'm a recycler, and a steampunker. So, you know, everything that I, I build, I try to buy nothing. I try to use recycled material whenever possible. And, uh, that's fun. You have a website, Facebook page? Actually, it's it's almost up. Facebook is Keith Edward out of San Diego. The new website is going to be blueswizard.rocks. It's going to tie everything together. So blueswizard.rocks is the new website. It should be up within a week.